One of the greatest compliments that I get from people regularly is, Ron, you have so much confidence. How do I go about getting the same type of confidence? Now, I'm very humbled and grateful when I hear this from people, but I want people to know that I have fears and insecurities like everybody else. Having said that, there are certain things that I have done over the years which have helped me produce an undefeatable mindset and I thought I would take the opportunity to share some of that with you. One of the first things that I do to develop the strength of my mind is to constantly venture in the direction of my fears. I have fears and insecurities as I mentioned earlier, but rather than letting those fears and insecurities stopping me, I move courageously in its direction. Now you'll find that as you do that over and over again, the hold of that fear is going to diminish on you and as you practice moving towards your fears more and more and more, you'll find that your mental strength will start to increase. The second thing that's really helped me build my mental strength and fortitude is to spend a lot of time on my own. Now I find that when you spend time in solitude and silence, you get this inner sense of calm and confidence which can really help you navigate through life's toughest challenges. The third thing that I have done which has really helped me produce mental resilience and agility is to take 100% responsibility for whatever happens to me or what happens around me. Now that's not the same as blaming yourself. Blame is highly negative, but taking responsibility can really empower you and make you very resourceful even when you're not directly responsible for something. The fourth thing that has really helped me develop my mental strength is to understand that there is no point wasting time on things that I can't control or influence. You see, there's a lot of things in life that we can influence, but there's always going to be things that we can't control and influence, but there is absolutely no point stressing about those things. Another thing that I do is I don't expect immediate results from any of the activities or endeavors that I engage in. You see, I very quickly learned the more we start to expect instant gratification, the weaker our mind becomes. The deferring gratification is a great way to build your mental strength. And the last thing that has really helped me build my mental strength is that I don't feel entitled and I've never acted like a victim. The more we act like victims and the more we become entitled, the weaker our mindset becomes. So one of the best ways to empower yourself from the inside out is to stop feeling entitled and stop acting like a victim and understand that you're truly a powerful human being that is able to achieve a lot of things in life. And the moment we start to act like victims and we start to act entitled, what we do is we actually start to weaken a lot of our inner capabilities.